Yo, what is going on you guys and welcome back to another video here on my channel. Now in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the modded outfit in the thumbnail and we're going to be doing the transfer glitch in order to get this outfit and if you didn't know the transfer glitch, it does unfortunately delete all of your saved outfits. So if you don't want all your saved outfits being deleted, then I recommend that you do not do this glitch. But at the end of the day, you're going to get back a cool modded outfit. And before we get into it, make sure you guys go ahead and drop a like and also if you haven't already subscribed, feel free to do so. But yeah, let's just jump straight into it. So to start off, make your way over over to the clothing store or anywhere where you can edit your saved outfits and then all you want to do is delete all of the outfits that you currently have saved so right here I just deleted all my outfits and then once you do that just make your way outside or you don't really have to make your way outside um, but pretty much all you want to do is bring up your map head over to online and swap characters Whenever you get to this screen right here, you want to make sure your male character is on the left. So make sure your male character is in the first slot. And if your male character is not in the first slot, then you cannot switch him around. So that means that you just cannot do this glitch. But if your male character is on the left side, all you want to do is switch over to the second slot and make a brand new female character. So just go ahead and make a brand new female character in the second slot. And if it asks you want to copy the rank, go ahead and accept that alert. And then just make sure it's a female character. So yeah, just make sure it's a female character, then hit save and continue, then enter a random name. And then after you give the character a name, just take the picture. And then whenever you take the picture, it should put you into a public session. So I'll see you guys when I get into the public session. All right, so whenever you get into the public session, all you wanna do is bring up your map and make sure you have the clothing stores. As you can see, I do not have the clothing stores. That's perfectly fine. If that happens, just go ahead and find a new session. Whenever you guys get into the new session, all you want to do is bring up your map and see if you have the clothing stores. This time you should have the clothing stores. And then if you have the clothing stores, just go ahead and bring up your interaction menu and make sure your spawn location is on last location. Then go ahead and enable passive mode. Then after you do that, make your way over to the clothing store. Whenever you get over to the clothing store, just go ahead and walk inside and copy my exact outfit. So to start off, all you want to do is make sure that you don't have any accessories on. So just walk over to the accessories and um, just go ahead and take off any accessories you're wearing. So like just like that, like I did, just take off the accessories and then after you do that, make your way over to the pants, then head down to sports pants and buy the spotted muscle pants. And then after you buy those, go over to the tops. So just walk over to the tops like this. And for the tops, you want to make your way down to the bustiers. So it's going to be down here. And you want to buy the till lace bustier. So this blue one right here, the till lace bustier. And then after you buy that, just go ahead and make your way over to the denim jackets. So the denim jackets are somewhere up here towards the, towards the top of the list. So right there, denim jackets. And you want to buy this one right here, the distressed denim jacket. So that one right there. And then after you buy that, make your way over to the accessories. And then whenever you get over to accessories, go down to the gloves and you want to buy the light woodland tactical gloves. So these gloves right here. And then after you buy those, all you want to do is head over to the shoes. So go over here to the shoes. And for the shoes, you're going to go down to high heel boots and you're going to look for number 24, which is going to be these right here, the deluxe midnight combat boots. So I'll just go ahead and buy those. And this is what the outfit should look like. And from here, just go ahead and walk up to the front counter and save the outfit in the first slot. So save it right there in the first slot like I do. And you can name it whatever, it really doesn't matter. Alright, so after you guys have made the outfit, just make sure your spawn location is on last location. Then if it is on last location, go ahead and take the easy way out. And then whenever you guys respawn, head over to online, then go down to creator and start up creator. Whenever you get into creator, just go down to create a race and then create a land race. 
and whenever you're right here on this screen bring up your map and you want to go over to the airport and set a waypoint and then whenever you set the waypoint it should just teleport you and then once you get to the airport go ahead and go to race details then enter in a random title and then enter in a random description then go down to photo and take a picture of whatever and then after you do that make sure the maximum players is set to two and then put the route type on point to point so it makes this whole process a lot faster and after you do that make sure you choose a fast vehicle so put the class on super then choose a fast vehicle and after you do that go over to placement place trigger and place the trigger in the exact same spot as i do it doesn't have to be exactly but somewhere around here so just about here and then after you place the trigger go down to lobby camera then take a random picture and then go to the checkpoints and you're gonna place checkpoints um in a straight line so right here where the trigger is just place one and then just after you place the first one just go in a straight line like i do so yeah pretty much just keep on placing checkpoints like this and while you're placing the checkpoints you want to look in the bottom right where it says race length and make sure that is at least 0 0.70 mi so as you can see right now it's like 0 0.40 something am i 0 0.42 so yeah uh just keep on placing them until it gets to 0 0.70 mi so we're almost there and this is going to be the last one so right there's the last checkpoint and then after you place the last checkpoint and your race length is at least 0 0.70 mi all you want to do is go ahead and save the race and then after you guys save the race just go ahead and test it all right after you test the race you should get this little alert right here and all you want to do is accept it and then after you accept it open your map head over to online and choose characters and then whenever you're on this screen right here just switch over to the second slot female character that we just made all the outfits on and then go ahead and delete that character so just like this it'll ask you to type in delete and then after you've deleted that character um it should put you back on the screen right here and all you want to do is press circle or b to make your way over to story mode and then whenever you get into story mode head over to online and make your way into an invite only or public session all right whenever you guys get into the invite only or the public session all you want to do is go um save the outfit that you're wearing so like i said in the beginning of the video you can save one outfit so this is the outfit i'm gonna be saving right here so just make sure that you save it or if you don't care about it you don't have to save it but uh, i'm gonna go ahead and save mine all right so right there i saved my outfit as you can see there it goes and then after you save the outfit just go ahead and make your way over to the clothing store All right, whenever you guys get over to the clothing store, just go ahead and walk inside and make your way up to the front counter. So right here on the front counter, then um, hit right on the D-pad and then you just want to go down to the scuba suits or not the scuba suits, the Gorka suits actually. So just find the Gorka suits right there, Gorka suits, and you want to equip the same one as I do. So it's going to be this one right here, the um, white camo Gorka suit. So that one right there. And then after you equipped it, just go ahead and bring up your map, head over to online jobs play job rockstar created versus and go ahead and start crooked cop so right there crooked cop and then whenever you're on this screen right here make sure you set the clothing to player own then confirm the settings and invite somebody all right so after somebody joins just go ahead and launch the mission and then whenever you're on this screen right here just go one time to the right and it's simple as that you should have the complete outfit so yeah just go one time to the right then ready up Alright, and then whenever you load in, um, right here on this screen, all you want to do is open your interaction menu and then equip the earpiece or rebreather. And then after you do that, just go ahead and bring up your phone, then go ahead and quit the job. And then whenever you get out of Cricket Cop, you should still be wearing the outfit like I am right here. And then if you're still wearing it, just go ahead and run down the street to the clothing store. So there should be a clothing store right down the street. and um basically we're pretty much done with the glitch but keep watching because i'm gonna show you guys how to make the outfit look even better like i'm gonna show you guys how to mod it and add the hat and everything that i did in the thumbnail so yeah just keep watching if you want to know how to do that but pretty much you, from this point you could just take off the earpiece um i took it off because i don't really like it and then after you take it off you could just go ahead and save the outfit much name it whatever you want so right there i saved the outfit and then now i'm gonna show you guys how to make it uh how to basically mod it the way i did in the thumbnail so yeah basically all you want to do is make your way over to the mask shop and then go over to the hats and you want to go to canvas hats and equip this hat right here it's going to be the white canvas hat so it's somewhere around here that one right there so just go ahead and equip it and then after you equipped it you want to go ahead and save the outfit 
so save the outfit and name it something that you'll remember because we're going to need to know what we named it earlier and then uh after you save it just there should be like uh some telescopes on this pier right here so yeah just go over to the pier because we're going to need to do the telescope glitch all right, and then whenever you get over to the pier, all you want to do is go ahead and equip there a breather. Then from here, just run past the telescope, hit right on the D-pad, and keep spamming X or A. And then whenever your character glitches out like that, bring up your interaction menu and equip the uh, outfit that has the hat on it. And just like that, the rebreather, it should glitch onto the outfit like that. All right, so now we're going to be adding gloves to the outfit. So for this, just go ahead and make your way over to the clothing store, then go over to the accessories. And then whenever you get over to the accessories, go down to the gloves and you can pretty much equip any gloves you want. But um, these right here, the white cotton gloves, they look good on this outfit and also the white surgical gloves. But honestly, I like the white surgical gloves a little bit more. So I'm gonna go ahead and get those. And, and this is exactly what the outfit should look like. Um, it looks like a, you know, a pretty sweaty try hard outfit. That's why I really like this outfit. But yeah, um, from here, you can go ahead and save the outfit, and we're pretty much done with the glitch, so I'm going to just go ahead and save it right here. But yeah, that is going to do for today's video, you guys. I really hope that you did enjoy, and if you did enjoy, make sure you drop a like, and if you haven't already subscribed, what are you doing? Just go ahead and subscribe right now, because I'm going to be posting um, a lot more. I've been really inactive recently, but don't worry, I'm starting to slowly get back into the groove of posting videos. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. Also, I'm going to have a white jogger uh, video soon. Um, a white jogger glitch like how to get white jogger soon whenever I buy my capture card which should be in the next couple weeks but uh yeah with all that being said I hope you guys did enjoy today's video and I'll see y'all all in the next one